Pakistan extends Turkey's deadline for sending T-129 helicopters. Ankara, Turkey, Pakistan has extended the deadline for the Turkish aerospace industry to send 30 T-129 combat helicopters to order, amid U.S. reluctance to grant Turkish technology export licenses. With the American move now seriously jeopardizing sales, the Turkish government has commissioned Tusa's Engine Industries, a sister company of Turkish Aerospace Industries, by developing an original engine for T-129. <music> Pakistan has agreed to give us one more year to resolve the problem. We hope we will be able to develop our original engine soon to power T-129. Ismail Demir, head of Turkey's main procurement agency, said January 6. After one year, Pakistan might be satisfied with the level of progress in us. The engine program, or the U.S. can grant us an export license. In 2018, Turkish Aerospace Industries signed a $1.5 billion agreement to sell 30 T-129 helicopters to Pakistan. However, companies need to secure U.S. export licenses for every export agreement with a third country. Turkish Aerospace Industries manufactures 5-ton attack helicopters, which are based on its predecessor, the A-129 Mangusta. The T-129 is a dual-engine attack helicopter manufactured under license from the Italian-British company Augusta Westland. It is powered by two LHTECT-800-4A turboshift engines. Each machine can produce 1,014 kilowatts of output power. T-800-4A is an export version of the CTS-800 engine. LHTEC a machine maker, is a joint venture between American company Honeywell and British company Rolls-Royce. A procurement source told Defense News on January 10 that Pakistan was also lobbying the U.S. to support the agreement. But U.S. diplomatic sources in Ankara say it is likely that Washington will not issue licenses given the cold nature of the U.S.-Turkey defense procurement ties. The United States last year suspended Turkey's membership in the multinational joint strike fighter program in response to Turkey's acquisition of Russia's S-400 air defense system. But industry sources warn that a successful engine development program will take at least 5 to 10 years. Turkish Aerospace Industries recently sent its 56th combat helicopter to the Turkish military. Thank you for watching my channel, this video is just an illustration, I hope you can understand it. Thank you my friend.